Live and I first introduce you to our next guest, Les. December, for nearly a decade, Brianna Davison has transformed lives all across the world. Her magic touch restores the confidence of girls experiencing hair loss for a variety of reasons. And now she's out with a new book and she's taking her mission on the road. Brianna is here with us to discuss all that and more. You have so much going on. Hi. Oh, hey, how are you? Oh my goodness. Okay, so first of all, tell everybody what you do because you have a very interesting title. Yes, so I am a hair loss specialist. I make wigs for children who are battling any type of hair loss condition. Um, that can be hereditary or any type of alopecia, cancer, or anything that it causes the hair to fall out. And you know, it's interesting because we met on a tour at, yes. on the campus of St. Jude <laughs> yes. and you've been an ambassador for a minute and you know, just seeing some of the images that you've shown of helping the children um, who've experienced cancer, can't grow their hair. Um, you then went out of your pocket for years and yes. paid for a wig tour. Tell me about that and how everything has evolved. So it started out, um, I did a giveaway here in Memphis and I had them to enter in and put where they're from and come to find out it was girls all over the world. So I end up just like, hey, I'm gonna go on tour. Like, I'm gonna go on tour. So I went on tour for the first year. I had no blueprint, literally step by step. I just was figuring it out and I did a 10 city tour. But the kids, you would surprise them. You'd show up with a, a hair piece, yes, right? And, yes. Oh my goodness. And the looks on their face is just amazing. And so how can somebody nominate someone to be part of your Kid Wix tour? Yeah, I have a website right now. It is, they can go to www.kidsweektour.com and nominate the girl. Okay, now let's get to the nitty gritty here. You wrote a book. Yeah. Oh my goodness, how amazing. And I mean, okay, yeah, that's the uh, adjusting crowns information. And then tell me how the book came about. So the book came about when I figured out that most girls didn't want to wear wigs. Like most girls are confident. And that's the part of everything that I do want to bring forth because everyone that's experiencing hair loss, they don't want to wear wigs. So I created the book because I'm like, I want them to see themselves. I want it to be a mirror. And I want them to see that, you know, you're not alone and you know, that I see you, right? And Invisible Crown, how'd you come up with that name? So, wigs can be known as crowns nowadays. Like when girls don't have hair, the wig, you know, per se, is the crown. But when you don't want to wear a wig, like I was saying for the girls who are confident, when they don't have a wig on, I need them to understand that they still have a crown there. That's so beautiful. And you also have something to go along with the book. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so, I now have a coloring book um, that's pretty much just like my actual book. So the coloring book is what I brought today. Um, this is the first time I ever mentioned this to the world. Oh, hello, yeah. right here <laughs> on Live at Nine. So that's exciting. Yeah. And you know, I think people might know you because you have quite the Instagram following. Um, you went viral at one point. Can you just talk about that moment? I know we touched on it in December, but um, and how that's changed your life. And now you're global. Yes, yes. So it started with one Instagram post. I posted a before and after of one of my clients and the post went viral like overnight. And I thought something was going on. Like I thought something was happening cause I was getting so many notifications. Like bing, bing, yes. bing, your phone just starts. Yes, and I noticed that the post actually went viral and it just went from there. And I mean, I've, I've done a lot ever since then. Wow. And so anything else you need to tell us? Because I know that um, you have been going overseas and you, you have plans to do that more. And a lot of the children from overseas have been reaching out and how people can just get more information and, and buy the, uh, the coloring book or book. Yeah. So I have, I've, so with the entries, when they enter in, they automatically put where they're from. And I noticed that I've gotten, I've gotten a lot of girls from Ghana, from all types, all parts of Africa. And that, you know, kind of triggered me because I'm like, they are really overseas, like they're really out of the country. So at this point, we're, we're really going global. 
Wow. Yeah. All right. And once again, um, the website you said uh, there's Kid with Tour. Yes. Kid Kids Week Tour dot com. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much for being an inspiration. And I I I kind of feel like it's almost a ministry sometimes when I'm hearing you um, share your messages on Instagram. So thank yeah. you so much. Thank and you. if anybody is looking for you on Instagram, really fast. Yes. They can find me at Bree Styles. That's underscore Bree Styles with a Z underscore. All right. B R I. Okay. Thank you, Brianna Davison. Thank you.